Some say rock and roll is dead. The golden age of touring is over. 23 people on a bus makes no sense. Then again, nothing we do makes sense. <laughs> March 4th Marching Band is one of the hardest working bands in show business. The band is on the road over 200 days a year, chalking up hundreds of thousands of road miles, and has played in over 40 states, Europe, and China. Living on a bus with 23 people takes a certain kind of person. My brother says people get really upset with people for drinking beer at breakfast. But what hypocrites? I mean, mimosas are okay, Bloody Mary's okay, but beer isn't? That is just plain wrong. Ryan's the asshole. <laughs> and he knows it. Looks like a C-plus job to me. Mary's the, the fairy sprite love rocket bomb of flames and fire. <laughs> she just add some spice to the top. Chad was solid. He's just solid. Whose guys are gonna feel it? Put on a happy face. John is like the sometimes frazzled creative director guy. I play bass and am the band leader. So we just drove three days. We made it to Ohio. The bad news is they moved the festival to Vermont. So. <laughs> Bullshit! March 4th is the definition of DIY. One of the ways I like to bring fashion to the function is by welding the drum harnesses. The band manages itself, making its own costumes and merchandise to sell to fans. And when the band's tour bus broke down, their fans bought them a new one. With March 4th's ruthless touring schedule, relationships back home are struggling. Well, three weeks is just a long time to kind of forget you have a partner after. I know there's no one else there, so yeah. you start to realize you can take care of yourself and what's the point of having a relationship. But life on the road isn't always pretty. I gotta piss. Where do you piss? Around here in Illinois. Injuries. I've got whack in the face. Still. Yeah. Look at that, it's all purple. Bus breakdowns. So it looks like we've maybe thrown our uh, our starter engine. Missed gigs. The bus will not make the gig on time. So right. to yes. get to the gig, we've got to go off the bus. They are facing some serious challenges in the coming year. And some of the gigs haven't been paying off. And... Yeah. How long can they survive on poverty level wages? The band makes the best out of the hardships. The band is back on the road, but they're late for their gig. But they're all giving it another go with hopes that they'll make it to the next level. Is this the last chance for the band to really make it? Or will the band crumble under its own weight and ambition? Join us each week as we jump on tour with the band as they journey across the country, living on the road, surviving together. A date. A command. A band. March 4th. All right, the bus is leaving. Time to go.